Question. You are hosting an application on bare metal servers in your own data center. The application needs access to cloud storage. However, security policies prevent the servers hosting the application from having public IP addresses or access to the internet. You want to follow Google recommended practices to provide the application with access to cloud storage. What should you do? Option A1. Use NS Lookup to get the IP address for storage.googleapis.com. 2. Negotiate with the security team to be able to give a public IP address to the servers. 3. Only allow egress traffic from those servers to the IP addresses for storage.googleapis.com. Option B1. Using Cloud VPN, create a VPN tunnel to a virtual private cloud, VPC, in Google Cloud. 2. In this VPC, create a Compute Engine instance and install the Squid Proxy server on this instance. 3. Configure your servers to use that instance as a proxy to access cloud storage. Option C1. Use Migrate for Compute Engine, formerly known as Velostrata, to migrate those servers to Compute Engine. 2. Create an internal load balancer, ILB, that uses storage.googleapis.com as backend. 3. Configure your new instances to use this ILB as proxy. Option D1. Using Cloud VPN or Interconnect, create a tunnel to a VPC in Google Cloud. 2. Use Cloud Router to create a custom root advertisement for 199.36.153.4/30. Announce that network to your on-premises network through the VPN tunnel. 3. In your on-premises network, configure your DNS server to resolve. Googleapis.com is a CNAME to restricted.googleapis.com. Now take 10 seconds to think about the answer. A. It's bad practice to use NS Lookup to try find a permanent IP address because IPs can change. That's what DNS is for. Also, the security team aren't going to budge. This is not correct. B. Anytime a question mentions on-prem and cloud, Google wants you to think about cloud VPN. This solution might even work, but installing Squid. This is a bad solution to a more simple problem. C. Talk about using a sledgehammer to swat a mosquito. I think this could work, but migrating servers to cloud to solve a simple networking problem. D. Once more Google's favorite cloud VPN is in the answer. Correct answer should be D.